All right, I thought I'd do an overview of this entire socket set. So at the top here, yeah, let me show you the whole thing. As you can see, this whole thing is massive. This thing is massive. Right, let's start at the top. So these deep sockets here, these are free eight drive and they go from 8mm to 19mm and that is 3 8 drive as I said from 8mm to 19mm those deep, those deep sockets are 3 8 drive so those are all the sizes in 3 8 drive deep now these ones or um, half inch drive and they go from 13 mil all the way to 27 mil so these are all the sizes in half inch drive deep sockets yeah and then you got the specialist wall sockets here I probably won't really use these because I haven't got a car at the moment so now the ratchet spanners go from 6mm down to 19mm so these are, you can see all the numbers there and these are all ratchet spanners the ratchet is quite smooth as well the ratchet is Even a bigger one, really smooth. Now going down now, this top row, these are all half inch sockets, and the smallest one, that is a 13. And by the way, all these sockets are six sided. I would have preferred if there were 12 point because 12 point is a bit easier in um, tight, low, tight, tight spaces and this sort of holds it as well so not fall out that they do hold in so that's 13 mil all the way up to 36 mil to the big one there 36 mil. Yeah, it's like a locking sort of mechanism that holds it in. The next row, these are half inch, and the half inch ones, smallest, is the um, 8 mil up to 24 mil and those these ones are 3 8 drive now these ones are the I think they call them the e-talks these ones and the biggest one is e, E20 e and the smallest ones are E8 Got quite a big breaker bar there. You know, most I think the old the old um, version of this, the breaker bar's already that long, useless. Now the big this first one, this is the half inch ratchet, and it is longer than standard half inch ratchets. It's quite a big ratchet, is the size of it. Very smooth ratchet as well. 
Feels good, man. Got a nice weight to it. So to service it, you see, you got a circlet there to take out. If you clean it and oil it in the future. No, this is the free eight drive um, ratchet. Now there's a quarter drive one, a little baby one. Now that one just feels a bit stiff. That's not the smoothest ratchet I've felt before. Maybe just needs a bit of oil in it, it could be that. That one does feel a bit stiff. And that's not good for even in a tight space. And then you got the you got the handle there. Um, this handle you can also put the ratchet in there as well. You see. And you got some adding keys at the bottom there. One point five. The ten mil. The board end at the bottom as well. You got some screwdriver bits there. Got some other ones down there. Now there's a little there's, there's a quarter cool drive bit converter. And you put this on that. So you can put these bits in. Let me show you. For those that don't know. You see? I know from previous experience, these bit, bit adapters, these ones have got like a little spring clip in it, and after a while, they do wear out after a while, it does pop out. That's the only downside to this um, socket set, really, that one of the downsides. But the thing is, you do get a lifetime, um, a lifetime guarantee. Because I've, I've actually bought a few of these separate. Harvards, and when the things come out, I've just put it back and they've given me a new one. I have some other bit converters. Well, these this is for the um, this is for the, the bigger bits. So, when you're using these, that goes in like that. And that's free at, free at drive that is. So we're using those, those these ones down there. These are um, what are these? Torques. These are torques bits down there. So that goes in there. Then of course you put your ratchet in there like that. Well, these are security torques because you can see it's got a hole in it down there. So these torques down there, they go from T20 all the way to M, actually now it's different, T20 to T50, and these are spline I think, they call these spline, these are different, these are actually different, they're not torques, spline. See so yeah, the T20 torques, as I was saying, to T50. And the splines they go from M5 to M12. As I was saying, don't get them mixed up. Spline and talks two different things.
So here you've got the quarter drive socket sets here. 14 mil down to 4 mil. So these ones down there for the little wrench down there. And you got um some more bits down there, shuttle ones. So you got the adding key bits there, hex bits, whatever you want to call them. Four up to twelve. Up to twelve mil. Then you got some splines, short splines there, M5 up to M12, shorter ones. At the top you got some torques, some shorter torques. T20 up to, what's that there? T55. And let's go along now. Got a free at drive extension there. And these extensions, they've got like a wobble. They've got the wobble thing on it. See how that's shaped? It's not straight. Like the regular um, extensions. So you pull it in there. See that? Yeah, this camera ain't really, it's a bit slow this lens when it comes to focusing. Well, to get the wobble feature, you don't put it on all the way, you sort of put it on half, half the way. Like that. And you push it down. Oh. So you put it on half the way and you get the wobble. If you're on the spot that's quite tight. And then you've got a, a quarter drive extension there. And you've got a quarter drive extension. And same thing, the quarter drive one's got a little wobble thing on it as well. Yeah, this camera doesn't want to focus. So look. The same thing has got the wobble thing on it. Then you got a longer free air drive extension there. Got um got a half inch extension. Got a smaller half inch extension as well. And at the top here, you've got some universal joints, but these are the impact ones. And these don't sort of lock up like normal ones, you see. And that's the quarter drive. Um, Universal joint. Then you got a free at drive. Universal joint there as well. And then you got the half inch. Universal joint there. Yeah, this this set has got everything in it. And then here, these are for the ratchet spanners. I'll show you what these are used for. You got a, um, a 30 mil one there. There's a, um, a 10 mil there. That's for a 10 mil. That one there. And that one is a 13 mil. 
and then you've got a 19 one there. And I'll show you what these are for. Now, so what you do, yeah, with these, so this one there is a 10 mil. See what you do, you grab the 10 mil ratchet spanner, or it could be the open end. See that there? So you put that in like that. You grab a, for example, you grab a 10 mil, and you put a 10 mil on that bit. And then you can use that in the confined space if the ratchet is too big to get in there. Now that, that's what those are for. Now here's the 19 one. So you put that 19 spanner, put that through there. Then you grab a half inch socket for some parts 50 mil. And you see, same thing as that. So that's what they're for. But I don't know, I'm a bit confused by the smaller one here. By that one, I don't know how he would use that, I don't know. Because you can't put the bit at the end of that. But that's got, um, or maybe that's for the Allen keys, I don't really know. What you'd use that for, I don't know. But, Confusing that. Alright, so it says 30 mil on there, bit adapter for 30 mil spanner. So I'm guessing you put that in there and then you put your bit in there. But I don't know, I can't see myself using that. I just don't know, you never know, but I don't really see the point in that. I don't know. Because that is probably the same width. No. Uh, so I don't know. Maybe, well, actually, yeah, it is a bit shorter. Because you're doing away with, um. I guess you're doing away with that. So, yeah, that does, yeah, I can see the point now, yeah. So this this can probably get into tighter spaces, obviously. All right, so here's the quarter drive, deep sockets, and they range from four mil up to fourteen mil. And you've got some adding key bits there, from four mil to twelve mil. And there you got your spark plug sockets there. With a little piece of rubber in it. Hold the spark plug and they're 10, 12 and 40 mil. And I don't think I mentioned that one. You got another bit adapter there. For the um for the bits here. And this is a half half inch one. And these these ones here are the same. They'll fit into that as well. So you can either use it on the half inch ratchet or the freight drive ratchet. These bits now, these bits along here. Yeah, I think that's it now. So I think that's it now. I think I've been through the whole thing now. Yeah, the reason why I bought this, I bought this for home use. I bought this for the RC cars and. Um, other projects and stuff because the thing is yeah I really got a socket set there smaller one yeah, there's nothing wrong with this one but there are a few things that were missing out of this one that I needed there were a few things like um, ratchet spanners and um, bit adapters and see these universal joints because these ones don't lock like these normal ones here See a standard one, not the lock, the lock up if you go and take a really tight angle. And I thought to myself, rather than be buying all these little separate bricks, I might as well buy the whole thing. I've got it there for future use. I've got the whole thing there, everything. 
and plus it was a good it was a good offer you know Black Friday and with all the discounts I had as well I thought I might as well buy the whole thing and that's it I've got everything now and I almost forgot you know I forgot I forgot about these they mentioned these these are adapters well these are quite handy I'll tell you what these are handy for if you have to use a torque wrench because the torque wrench you're using it might not have the right um, bit at the end of it that's, that's one use for these that's quite handy so the first one is that's female free eight drive to quarter drive mill that's the first one there the second one is female quarter drive to um, mill free eight drive no the third one is female half inch drive to male free eight drive and the last one is female three eight drive to male half inch drive see what I mean this has got this set is it's got everything in it you know it's got everything you need in it and if you were to buy all these separates, separates, you know, it would cost a lot more than what this set cost. It would cost a lot more. And these spanners here, it's like a new sort of um, design. They claim that it locks into the bulb bit. I don't know if you can see that there. Yeah, you can see it better there, yeah. See, it's not completely straight. It's got like a jagged edge to it. Yeah, this has got bloody, this is everything, everything. So you've got a hole there, so you can paddle up the box if you want. And it's got like a hinge at the side as well. There's another hinge on the other side. And that's what I was saying in my previous video, this thing is heavy, trust me. This thing is heavy. It is, it is not like this thing, man.